Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, I'm Crystal, and today we are doing a Walmart haul. Um, I went in the store to try to find some really cute summer outfits, and I couldn't find anything that really just made me want to pay for it and take it home, to be honest. It just... I, nothing really stood out to me. I even looked online. I still couldn't find, uh, I really couldn't find a lot of stuff that I was like, I have to have it. You know what I mean? So I don't have like the, well, we've got workout stuff. We've got like, like athletic type stuff, athleisure, whatever you want to call it. Um, we're going to try that on. We do have a little haul, but before I show you what I got, go ahead and take just a moment to subscribe. It's free and you will be notified whenever I upload new videos, which is quite regularly. And uh, yeah, so with that said, let's look at what I got. All right, like I told you, it's like athletic type stuff, all right? But I will say if these turn out good, I might have possibly found a dupe for, is it the Lululemon? like running shorts. Is that what it is? Let's see. Let us see. Yes. Okay, guys. So if these turn out nicely, we could have found a very inexpensive dupe for the Lululemon running shorts. Okay. I have three pair. I have red. I have the white because these just intrigued me to see if they would be see-through. So I have a white pair. And both of these are the Athletic Works brand, I think is what it's called. Yeah. And then I have a pair of Avia. Yeah. So we will see what's up and try all of these out. All right, so let's just, you know what, let's just jump in. All right, first, let's go with these white ones because they have me the most intrigued. Okay, so this pair has pockets, guys, and it also has like the built-in chones. Um, I'm gonna be honest with you. I still wear my undies with these. Um, I don't just use these as undies. That's just, no, no. Okay. So um, I'm going to have on blue undies and we're going to see if we can see straight through these. Okay. So I don't know. We will see. I got these in a size small, with, which is a four six. And these are supposed to be Dry Works moisture wicking to keep you dry and cool. And these were $10.98. So not a bad price compared to the Lululemon ones that are $68. They have this cute like little mesh like jersey type material hanging out of the bottom, which is just cute, you know, attention to detail. And then of course the pockets is great. I hope these aren't see-through because I think these are going to be really cute to wear during the summer and really cool. You know what I mean? So I hope they work. And then I'm not normally real big on like athletic tops like this, but I do like to run in tops like these. And when I saw this one, I was like, why not? I got it in an extra small because I wanted it to fit like a little bit more fitted, not be loose. And I just thought this pink color was really, really cute. And this top, was $5.98 and it's also the Athletic Works company which is like I want to say like their version of like a really expen uh, expensive inexpensive like athletic brand so I'm curious to see how this works out I'm sorry guys my nose is itchy right here for some reason oh so itchy probably allergies allergies are kicking my bootay i will say i'm not feeling too um it's not looking too promising because the label is printed crooked so let's try on the pink top and the white shorts and hold on i got some sports bras just because i've really been into sports bras that are more like comfortable less like high impact and more 
just, you know, relaxed, more comfy. This one is a new, no, no boundaries. I almost said new balance. Ha, huh, funny. Uh, no boundaries, like bralette type thing. It does have padding, does have the little cups in it, and they are removable. Um, obviously, this is in white. Um, and I have no idea how much it is because even when I bought it, there's no price on the little thing, like the little perforated thing you can rip off. There's no price on it. I have no idea how much this is. I think it was around $10, which is pricey for this. So let's try this on with the white shorts and the pink top and see how it fits. I got it in a size small, so we will see. But let's throw this little, little fit we've got going on. Let's throw it on and see what's up, guys. Okay, guys, so actually, uh, I'm impressed. I'm actually kind of shocked. All right, first off, this is incredibly comfortable. This is a comfortable waistband. These, I assumed, were going to fit super tight and almost like squish everything up, which is not flattering and not comfortable, but these don't. They fit really, really nicely, okay? I am so excited about how they fit. Also, I don't think you can see through them, can you? Okay, you tell me if you can see my blue underwear through these shorts. All right, I won't know until, I won't know until I edit this video, so. Hopefully you can't, but it's nothing a nude pair of underwear won't fix, and they're not like shockingly see-through. Like I, well, I can see the pocket here through it, but, it's not bad. I really like these. They're very comfortable. And the pockets are a nice size. I like these. They aren't too short. They aren't too short. They aren't too long. They work nicely on the booty. I like how they added this material to make them a little bit longer. I like how they come up on the side. The material is really, really nice. Like, guys, these are really nice shorts. What the heck? I was, I was almost dead said that these are going to be a flop. So I'm impressed. All right. So next up is this T, this little athletic top. First of all, the V-neck is nice. It lays flat. It doesn't like, I've got the hiccups. It doesn't like gape open whenever you bend over, which is nice because I hate it when it does that. When you bend over to like pick up a weight and you're working out, you don't want your boobs to fall out of your top. Um, I would say you could probably size down if you want it to fit tighter like mine does. And it's still like looser down here, but it's nice, you know? It fits nice under the armpits. So if it is actually moisture wicking, it will help like catch moisture and all that stuff and help keep you dry, which is really awesome. The pink color is very vibrant, very cute. It looks really cute with these shorts. All right, so I mean, I give the shorts in the top a 10 out of 10. You can't go wrong. This was a $6 top. They had other colors as well, so. I'm kind of astonished, to be honest. Um, next up is this little bralette. Okay, so first things first. I don't love that you can see the cups through the bra. It just like screams like, here are where my boobs are placed. You know what I mean? But other than that, the small fits really nicely. It's got a good amount of stretch. It's not uncomfortable in any way. The straps are a perfect length. It's very comfortable. Um, I'm impressed with all of it. I'm impressed. Moving on. Okay. So next up, you know what? Let's go ahead and throw on this black pair. Okay, so this is the Avia brand. I got this in a small, which is a 4.6. And these were $12.98. Oh, okay, never mind, sorry. It just is saying that it contains at least 48% uh, recycled materials or whatever. So, okay, cool. Um, these are also supposed to be moisture wicking, spandex, comfort stretch, zipped po zippered pockets. Where? Oh my gosh, it does. And they're like hidden. They are quite small pockets, like 
my phone's not gonna fit in there that's for sure and those are the only pockets are the zippered wait you was that plural pocket there's one pocket one zippered pocket right here guys it says for your essentials what essentials my phone is essential guys look at this my phone's not fitting in here neither is probably anyone else's phone i guess for like your key and maybe your id if you need that you can put it in there but other than that that'll see it i will say these look longer so we will see what's up with that and instead of these having like the more bikini style chones built in these have like shorts they have shorts built in which will probably be way more comfortable than the like bikini style chones so we will see what's up with these and then i also got this no boundaries black bralette this one's got more of a square neck type going on the straps are not adjustable so if they're too long they're too long again i have no idea how much i paid for this it does have removable pads removable cups in here if you don't want them and this one also does not have the price on the little tag thing um, again, I think I paid like $10. I will attempt to link everything in the description box down below for you guys, but I think it was like $10. So let's see what's up. I mean, this is cute. It's ribbed and it seems to be like very thick and made well. So not going to knock it till I try it. Uh, so we're going to try that on and then we will also try on this long sleeve avia top it is a workout top it is ruched on the sides i wish you could feel this fabric because it is so stretchy and so soft it does have like this detail on the back like this line down the back and like i pointed out it is ruched on the sides i got this in a small and it is 13 it was 13.98 so not too bad it has thumb holes so you can put your thumb through the little hole in the sleeve this is a really stretchy really thin but not in a bad way type material and the reason why i got this long sleeve with it you know going into like summer spring summer was because i actually do like to work out in long sleeves a lot of times and this seemed so thin that it would be okay even when it were you know like if it were hot so i'm here for it it's very nice i like the material i don't know how it'll look with these shorts but let's throw this on and see what this little fit looks like okay guys so here is the next little fit all right so I'm going to be honest with you. I don't hate these shorts. These shorts are nice. Okay, so don't get me wrong. These shorts are nice. I don't like how tight the bottom part of the, like, built-in shorts. I don't like how tight it is on the thigh. I mean, I understand it's to keep it... I mean, they're not uncomfortable, but I understand it's to keep it down because you don't want it to ride up, but... It's a little tight, so if you have, like, bigger thighs, be very careful. Um, just, yeah, you. it might be super uncomfortable if you have, like, larger thighs. Uh, this material isn't as soft. They are longer, obviously. These are, you know, more appropriate then well the other ones weren't inappropriately short to be honest i mean these are nice though these are nice i'm just letting you know that if you have bigger thighs be careful about this part um other than that they're very comfortable the waistband isn't overly tight i like how thick the waistband is and these are high-waisted the other ones were not high-waisted these are a high-waisted short so that is amazing I mean, other than the fact that this zipper pocket is laughable and it goes backwards, like, 
I don't know. There's no place to put your cell phone. Of course, there's no place in the other one to put your cell phone. But I'm just saying, like, don't expect this zippered pocket to be the be-all and end-all whenever it comes to storing your shit because it's not, okay? All right, so here we are. You can put your thumbs through the holes. This shirt is where it's at, by the way. This is so comfortable. It is so thin, but in a really nice way. Not like in a, this is a cheap piece of crap kind of way, just in like a this will be comfortable kind of way. I like the ruched part, but honestly, even if it wasn't ruched, I would still really like this. Like this isn't a selling feature for me. Um, you can make it shorter on the sides if you want to do that. So you can make it more of like a cropped top if you wanted, but where it's at is just fine. Like it fits really nicely. I was afraid it was going to fit really like baggy, but it really doesn't. This is actually impressive. Very impressive. So I would give these shorts like an eight and a half out of 10. They're still good. They're still comfortable, but this zipper pocket is just hilarious. <laughs> And they didn't give you other pockets. If they had given me other pockets plus the zipper pocket, it'd be different, but there's no other pockets. Um, the top, 10 out of 10 for sure, worth every penny. This is so comfortable. All right, now this bra, guys, it's squishing me to death on top. It's nice here. Up here, there's not a lot of give. Like, this is just structured. There's not a lot of give. It is squishing every bit of armpit fat that I have out, which is not flattering. It's not what we want. I'd say size up with this one if you get it, uh, just because it it's not is not the best. It's not the best. So I give it like a two out of ten. The top though, this top is where it's at. This is a good top. This is a good, comfortable, athletic top. Love it. The shorts are good too, but I really, I really love this top. So, okay. So we've got a few more pieces and then we'll be done. Okay. I picked up this Secret Treasures bra. And again, no price on this. Ha okay. I understand that some people, like myself, might just be like, all right, we'll take a gamble and hope that it's not super expensive. I mean, it's Walmart. But then again, there are certain people that have a budget and may want to know how much this is without having to go to a sales associate and say, can you scan this and let me know the price? I don't even know if Walmart has those scanners you can go to yourself and scan stuff just to, to check a price. I know Target does. I have no idea if Walmart does. This has removable cups. I got it in a small. I really like this gray on gray like leopard pattern and it is extremely soft. I like the thicker band at the bottom that's like seamless. It This is a really cute sports bra. Like I'm not even going to lie. It is super duper cute you know, really nice. Seems like really good quality. It's very, very, it's like buttery soft. All right. So we're going to try out this red pair of shorts. Again, same as the white. We've got a pocket. We've got a pocket. We've got the built-in chones that are like a bikini style in there. These again, in case you forgot, are $10.98. So 11 bucks for a pair of running shorts. Not too bad. Not too bad at all. Again, moisture wicking, stay dry, all that good stuff. Um, so we're going to try these on with this little bra. And then, guys, I've been seeing these kind of slides everywhere. Did these not look enormous? I've been seeing these everywhere, and I really loved this purple color. So I grabbed these, and I took the tag off so I could try them on. And I have no idea where it went. I think these were like 12 bucks. They weren't super expensive. These are no boundaries. I thought they were uh, no boundaries. And I got them in a size eight because they don't come in half sizes. And a seven was too small because I'm a seven and a, a seven and a half normally. 
And the eight is a little big, but I mean, you don't want them to be too small. So these look kind of silly, but they're actually kind of comfortable. So I just wanted to show these to you guys in case you were curious and I'll try to link them down below, but let's, uh, let's put this on so we can wrap up this video. Okay. I just threw on a little, a t-shirt because I didn't want to just be standing here in this bra and these shorts because this bra is another one where you can perfectly see each of the boot pads. Like, I don't like that. It's weird to me. I mostly take these padding things out and wear them without them, but I'm not going to take them out before them beforehand because I don't know if it'll be see-through and you'll be able to see my business like through it. But this one is very comfortable. This one is more geared towards like a woman's body and like actual boobs as opposed to the no boundary ones that are more geared towards, you know, tweens that don't really have a lot of boob. So anywho, these shorts, just like the white ones, but I wanted to show you what they look like. And I wanted to mention to you because I didn't mention earlier, I do not notice the built in undies in these shorts, the red or the white at all. Like I've had Nike ones before that had in the built in undies and it was so tight right here. Like every single move was like, ah, ah, you know what I mean? Nobody wants to go running or even like sitting in that sort of thing. But these are actually very, very comfortable, which is great because I was expecting it to be uncomfortable to the point where I probably cut them out and I don't have to do that. So yay. Also, here's the butt. They're very, very comfortable. Like true to size, very comfy, 10 out of 10. Love them. I just love them. Uh, this bra, 10 out of 10 as well. I mean, I don't like that you can see the pads through, but most people aren't walking around with their bras completely showing. So it's not really that big of a deal. So I really, I really like these shorts, man. I'm going to be living in these. I may have to go get more colors. Like these are just so cute. And again, pockets. It's got pockets. <laughs> okay. Anyways, let's go ahead wrap up this video guys <laughs> okay guys so what did you think about this little walmart haul i know so many people love walmart hauls i get it you want some really affordable inexpensive pieces you want to see the diamonds in the rough you want to see the dupes for other things i get it i understand and i want to provide that for you but at the same time I do not want to buy a bunch of junk just to try on and tell you it's junk. I want to find those really good pieces. I want to find the things that are a steal of a deal and a really good find. And I have done that so many times in the past. I have other Walmart hauls that you can check out if you want. But this time just isn't one of those times where Walmart is booming with a bunch of really trendy cute things. They're just not. And I hate that because I want to find, I want to find really cute affordable pieces for myself, but they just didn't have a lot. I mean, they had some cute Reebok stuff. I would not say that, that is necessarily like affordable and inexpensive and it's not a dupe for anything. I mean, it's Reebok. They had a whole Reebok section in Walmart. Time and True had some really cute dresses, but all of them looked like a business casual. And I don't go to an office every day, guys. And I don't need a crap ton of dresses that are appropriate for an office setting. I just didn't. So I know it's coming. They will, they move clothes in and out so quick. By the time I go back in, they will have different things. So there will be more Walmart bleh, Walmart hauls for you guys. Just keep watching, keep waiting, keep looking. Subscribe so you know when they go up. And I hope you enjoyed this video. Honestly, I think we found some pretty decent dupes for the Lululemon running shorts. You know, 
not bad little dupes for 11 12 bucks uh so many people are like try to find like dupes for i think the free people running shorts the ones with the really thick band and stuff i've seen so many people like on amazon trying to find dupes for things like lululemon and stuff like that so anywho i love you guys i hope you enjoyed this video i will see you next time bye bye